Hey everyone and welcome back to my channel. So today's video is going to be my weekly cleaning routine video. So in this video I'm going to take you throughout different areas of the house and just show you guys um, how I clean up the house and just kind of the weekly things that I like to keep up with. So if you are interested make sure to stay tuned. So I like to start by just straightening up the living room and here is Ricardo just saying hi. Um, he does like to help me around so he was just being silly but I like to straighten out all the throw pillows on the couches because we like you know kind of laying down and relaxing during the week so I just like making sure that everything's back in its place and you know just freshen it up. Um, I also love using like these throw blankets um, in the living room when we get cold and just you know watch a movie or whatever and right here I have Ice Age playing because why not? Um, so yeah so I like to keep these little throw blankets in this little basket because they are quick and easy to just grab and they come in handy so yeah I just keep them on there. And next I'll just start grabbing all the random stuff that's just laying around. Here I just had some like flyers and just like random things that tend to just stay in the uh, living room. So I'll do that. And sometimes on the mantle we'll also have just random things. So here's the GoPro and just like some random clips and just you know random things because I'm sure everyone has random things laying around. So I don't like having it all there so I'll just go ahead and put everything back in its place. Um, before I actually start the cleaning part of it. Okay, so before wiping down the coffee table, I have to, um, you know, blow off the candle that I had going on here and just remove um, the tray just to make sure I get everything clean. So now I'll go ahead and just spray the coffee table with some Mrs. Meyers multi-purpose um, spray. So here I have the basil scent and it smells so good. A lot of you guys recommended that I use more of the natural products um, after uh, watching my cleaning routine for my kitchen. So I did find this Mrs. Meyers and I love it. it smells so good. But yeah, I just like wiping everything down and I do have a microfiber um, washcloth here as well because a lot of you guys were like, oh, well, you shouldn't use paper towels. But I mean, for the kitchen, I like using that just because, I mean, the kitchen gets a lot more dirty. Um, but I do like this as well. So I'm just going to get everything um, clean and make sure all the dust is off uh, before putting everything back. I'll clean the bookcase because this can also accumulate dust throughout the week so I like just dusting off um, all the shelves that way um, you know it doesn't accumulate over the days. And then I'll also make sure to dust our mantle because I can also get dust on it. And then also our little end table, which uh, unfortunately you couldn't really see because I didn't really get it in the frame. But I, we do have a little one on the end there as well, so I get that. And next I'll just go ahead and put the tray back on the coffee table and then I'll also take everything off of that and clean off the tray as well just because that could also get some dust on it and by the way I love this tray that we found at TJ Maxx. Um, I linked it in a home decor, well I talked about it in a home decor video so I'll link that below. Um, but yeah, so I do that. All right, so we recently got this hardwood floor vacuum and it has been life-changing, oh my gosh. So we got this the other day and Ricardo was like, we have to get it. Um, so this is awesome because this is perfect for hardwood floors and it just picks up all the crumbs, anything on the floor and it's super, super quick and you know doesn't take as long as like a broom would. So I've been loving this lately. So I use this all over basically wherever we have the hardwood floor. Um, before passing the bone up. So another thing that we do weekly is take out the trash. Well, actually a couple of days a week. Um, but here I'm just taking out the trash and making sure that we get all the trash out the way and um, you know, there's nothing laying around because I really don't like having trash inside. Um, so we'll do that.
And then I'll go ahead and just put everything away. So I have my little lunch bag here that I take to work. So I'll go ahead and take anything out from it and just put things away. And then also I'm gonna make sure to wash any of the plates that I have in the sink and then also put the other uh, plates away as well. So next I'll wipe down all the countertops and I do this more of like spot maintenance cleaning and I'll actually do like a deep cleaning every other week. So here I was just kind of cleaning up basically the areas where that we use the most um, just to make sure that's clean and um, good to go. If you guys want to see a more in-depth cleaning of my kitchen, I'll leave my kitchen cleaning routine down below so you guys can check it out. Um, but next I also like passing the bone here after um, I've passed the vacuum um, just to make the floors look pretty shiny um, and be ready for the week. Next I'll also wipe down our breakfast table because we use this daily and it can get dirty throughout the week so I like wiping this down as well. Cleaning the bathrooms, and this is definitely something we like to do weekly because of obvious reasons. Um, but yes, yeah, so here I am cleaning up our guest bathroom, but I do clean all three. Um, and Ricardo really helps me out with this, but I'm just going to show you guys our guest bathroom because it would be a very long video if I showed you everything. But basically I like to just put some toilet cleaner, um, let that sink for a while, and then start taking everything off of the countertop so I can make sure to get everything really clean cleaning the countertops again, so more countertop cleaning, and then also the mirror. And next I'll just put everything back in its place and then move on to cleaning the floors. And for the floors in the bathroom, I like using this Swiffer mop because it's super um, good. It just picks up any dirt, dust on the floor, and you can easily you know, interchange um, the little inserts. So I like using this all over because um, it does a really good job of picking everything up. Now on to the laundry. So basically I like to hang things up to dry. Well, mostly my clothes, um, you know, any delicate clothes out to dry. So I have some here and I like just getting it and putting it back in its place because I don't like it to stay, you know, in the laundry room forever. So I'll put that away. I also like washing our sheets every week just because, you know, we sleep on them every day. So it's good to get them washed um, every week. So here I'm just putting them in the washer and then I'm going to go ahead and dry them. Everything's dry. I'll go ahead and just put um, our pillowcases back on the pillows. And I just love having fresh sheets and pillowcases just because it's a great way to start off the week. So I already had made the bed and I had used some of our extra sheets and stuff so that way I can alternate them but I do like to just tighten everything up and like I said we love throw blankets because we can you know use them but not have to mess up the whole bed and we can use them in the living room so here I'm just putting these away um, just to make sure the bed is nice and tidy. Now since we recently moved um, a couple months ago, we are still like purchasing all of our furniture so that's why our room is kind of empty right now. <laughs> but we did get our bed and that was like a huge like relief and just accomplishment so we have that. But I like going ahead and just vacuuming the room just to pick up any dust and just anything really and I love fresh vacuum lines on the carpet. I mean, does everyone like that? I just feel like it's like very nice and relieving and satisfying to see. Um, so here I am doing that. And for the carpet upstairs, I do like using our big vacuum because I just feel like this does a better job um, on really high pile um, carpet. So for the week, I really like focusing on rooms that we use a lot throughout the week. Um, and one of them is my office slash filming room. And now here, I mean, it could get really messy pretty quickly. So here I'm just going ahead and cleaning off my desk first because that really motivates me to actually get things done. Um, so here I have like a lot of cables and I honestly don't like seeing cables laying around. I don't know why, but I just feel like it's a lot cleaner without them. So I'm just picking up just random things I have here. 
Next, I'll clean off the desk with some Mrs. Myers, and my goodness, I love just how the scent of this just lingers. Um, it's just awesome. So yeah, I'll just wipe this down and then put everything back in its place. And next, I'll take out the trash because I really don't like keeping trash in the room. Um, and then I'll move on to my little vanity area here. And now this is another place that can also get really messy really quick because I just have like a random stuff and like my makeup and stuff. So first of all, I like just wiping everything off of this. So I can really clean the countertops and just make sure no makeup stains or anything are on it. all hidden with some more Mrs. Myers and clean off the glass. Um, the good thing about this little vanity is that um, it does have a glass top on it so it makes cleaning really really easy. The last thing I will do is vacuum the room and this is like my final step in here um, just because I like doing like the floors last. That is everything for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Make sure to thumbs up if you guys like cleaning routine videos so I know to make more. Also make sure that you're subscribed to my channel that way you are notified when I post a new video and I hope you guys are all having a wonderful day. Remember that you're all beautifully and wonderfully made and I will see you in my next video. Bye guys!